How many times do you have to charge your laptop a day? We know the question sounds weird, but this is the harsh truth of laptops. Being a portable device, the battery life of a laptop is very important as we have to use it on the go. And we get quite nice battery performance after buying a new laptop. The problem starts after using it for a few months or years. And we all know the later story, just plug in and plug out. But what if we say that we got some unique solutions that sound a bit tricky, but work really well? Yes, in this video, we will talk about some key configurations, tricks, and ways to improve your laptop battery life. So plug in your laptop and let's get started. If you aren't aware of Turbo Boost, let's have a quick pick. Turbo Boost is a feature in many modern processors that allows the CPU to run faster than its usual speed when needed. Now, what happens when a CPU runs faster than its natural speed? Due to its higher clock speed, it absorbs more power, which decreases battery life. If you limit the maximum power state from your laptop's battery configuration, you effectively disable the CPU's Turbo Boost feature. By capping it at 99%, the CPU won't boost. And the outcome? It will draw less power and lower temperatures, which results in longer battery life. Disabling Turbo Boost directly from the BIOS also reduces the processor's power consumption, similar to the first method. However, doing it through the BIOS might provide more consistent results because it prevents any software overrides that could enable boost temporarily. Needless to say, if you prioritize battery life instead of maximum performance, you have to ensure that the CPU operates more conservatively to reduce energy usage and extend battery life. Some laptops have discrete HDMI controllers that can draw power even when not in use, especially if the drivers aren't optimized. By updating the drivers, you can ensure the HDMI card enters a low power state when not in use. And removing it altogether, if feasible, eliminates any power draw from the HDMI card. This step is less common, but can be effective in specific scenarios where the HDMI card consumes a significant amount of power. Do you know about Hibernate Mode? It's a power-saving feature on your computer. When you put your computer into Hibernate Mode, it saves everything you're working on to your hard drive or SSD and then completely shuts down the computer. Unlike Sleep Mode, which keeps your computer in a low power state and still uses some battery, Hibernate Mode uses no power at all because the computer is turned off. When you turn it back on, it loads everything back up exactly as you left it, so you can continue working without losing any progress. This mode is especially useful when you won't be using your computer for an extended period, but want to resume your work quickly when you come back without draining your battery in the meantime. OptiWin is a tool that optimizes Windows built-in power management features more intelligently. It dynamically adjusts CPU resources and other components based on the task at hand and reduces unnecessary power consumption. For example, during tasks like web browsing or video streaming, it might lower the CPU's power state and disable unnecessary hardware components or manage background processes more efficiently, resulting in up to 47% less power usage. This approach can significantly extend battery life, particularly for users who are not technically skilled and prefer an automated solution. So the solutions we have talked about are all effective if you give them some time. But if you need a longer battery backup right now, you might consider having an external power pack. They provide an additional source of power to extend the time before your laptop's internal battery is fully charged. A portable power pack with a 20 watt power delivery and 10,000 milliamper capacity can add several hours of use, especially if you are doing light tasks like web browsing or word processing. But this doesn't improve the internal battery's efficiency. Instead, it provides more overall battery life when you're on the go, and you have to pay some bucks for this. So, these are the unique solutions to a better battery life no one talks about. Besides this, you can also try traditional ways to save your laptop battery. While using a laptop, simplify your workflow, close unnecessary apps, and perhaps consider airplane mode if required. You can go to your system's app settings and close specific apps that draw lots of power. You can help your laptop battery last longer by lowering your screen's overall brightness. Want to save even more power? Set your screen to automatically turn off after 60 seconds. Disconnect your mouse, headphones, or any USB drive from your laptop when you don't need them. 
When they're plugged in, these accessories draw power from your laptop battery. When you plug in your laptop, make sure to use the charger that came with your device. Other chargers may be cheaper, but they don't always work as well and can even damage your battery. And another thing to remind, don't charge frequently. It slowly damages battery capacity. Plug in your laptop when the battery percentage is below 10%. Your operating system is responsible for managing the software and hardware on your laptop. If it's outdated, it can cause problems with your battery. So keep your operating system up to date. If your battery gets too hot, it won't charge normally, which is why you optimize the airflow into and out of your laptop. If your fan continues to struggle, make noise, or run at high speed, then it's better to take your device to servicing. And lastly, don't forget to turn off your laptop after your work. As we mentioned earlier, keeping in sleep mode causes battery life. To help maintain your battery's ability to hold a charge, turn off your device at the end of each day. So, these are the tips and tricks to improve your laptop battery life. Let us know which one you found useful in the comments below. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to get more videos like this.